A Campbell River mother battling breast cancer wants people to listen to her story carefully. At just 32 years old and no family history, she didn't match any of the risk groups, but as Sky Ryan reports, cancer chose her anyway. We are going to make some baloney faces are all dropping down like no. Even in a routine moment like this one. You gonna make me a sandwich? Over her kids' lunch sure. breaks, Carrie make? Davison now finds a chance for affection. Thank you. Since the life-changing diagnosis this Campbell River mother was given a year ago. I was devastated. I spent a month where I looked at my kids and I would just cry. Diagnosed with breast cancer at just 32 years old. The mother of three young kids has since undergone a mastectomy and rounds of chemo and radiation, fighting the disease with everything she's got. I just went into that full-on soldier mode, like, okay, I have three kids. I am very lucky that I have three kids, and I need to get rid of this disease so that I can watch my kids grow up. Her 10-year-old daughter, Kaylin, was afraid. Sad because my mom has cancer. But this family has taken on this fight together, and Davison credits them for her survival. They're my cure in my eyes. They're the ones that got me to where I am now. She obviously means the world to me. She, she's the mother of our kids, she's my wife. And we grew up, we were high school sweethearts, and no, I couldn't live without her, so I'm glad she, we're making it through this. Now finished her final round of radiation with her last test cancer-free. Davison wants other women to think of her the next time they see their doctor, a woman with no family history of breast cancer and who was just starting her life overseas when she felt a lump and was told it was nothing to worry about. There's a lot of women that say, you know, I do have a lump. I went to my doctor and they said it felt fine. And, you know, I was told that for five years. So this young mom is so thankful for what she has now and all the people taking part in this weekend's run for the cure. You know, all I have to say is thank you. Raising funds that are making her chances of beating this disease in sight.